Historically, marijuana sold for the recreational user, pot, has been sold in ounces, or in the case of medical marijuana dispensaries, by the gram. And uh, factors that influence the price include things like the look and feel, the uh, how it's trimmed and how big the bud is, etc., etc. We find in the end that, of course, some of these factors, the look and feel, the, the branding or whatnot, have little to do, a little correlation with the effectiveness, how much THC there is, or how much CBD there is, or the taste, or anything else. So what I'm proposing is, as <clears throat> producers of topicals, metables, and concentrates, uh, by increasingly uh, larger amounts of cannabis for their products, those that see cannabis as an ingredient are going to value the same pile of plant material differently than those for the end user recreational market. To help with this transition and to capture the salient variables that influence the price of marijuana as a bulk agricultural commodity, I've written a spreadsheet that attempts to uh, correlate uh, chemical analysis through uh, uh, chromatography of the cannabinoid level, THC, CBD, for example, against the price so that you can see as a bulk seller or buyer where the value lies and where the price points are for um, things other than trimmed bud for the end user. So again, uh, jetcityorange.com slash cannabis, there's a spreadsheet, feedback is encouraged.